Hello, beta testers. Good job, pussy bitch. Good job, pussy bitch. Job, wow, I guess this guy won't like and subscribe. Incompetent multiplayer design director Jeffrey Smith made sure Call of Duty caters exclusively to campers, so Modern Warfare 2 is full of them. And I mean suppression mine on one door, two claymores on another door style camping. Now, I could toss a nade up there or use the drill charge since Call of Duty wants to be siege so damn bad, but I prefer a personal intimate touch. I find it produces better results. Good job, pussy bitch. Oh, How am I the pussy bitch when you're camping in here? I don't understand. Pussy. Good, Good job, job, pussy. pussy. Back in my day, Call of Duty was a fast-paced shooter that rewarded reflexes. These days, it seems to be disbanding every lobby to protect his little camp. This shotgun faggot. Somebody called me a shotgun faggot. You should have heard it. He pushed you yeah, out of the lobby. Shotgun, you're... See? He has Jesus is my king in his name, and he's calling people a shotgun faggot. His words. And I should be able to stay in this fucking lobby. Oh and my god. Exactly! You're not fucking good! Exactly! I should be able to do this all night and come in my fucking pants! Baked beans can get a little messy. Baked beans. But here comes Jeffrey Smith! I gotta make sure the lobby's just playing this little game! Slow down! You should be camping! Stop running around! I'ma make the food steps louder! I'm Jeffrey Smith! Has anybody seen my penis? It's just a bit of satire. It's just a bit of parody, you know? I don't know what the guy sounds like. All I know is he be talking about all of their different play styles as if anybody exists to him other than campers. Just kidding. Sentinels. Because camper is now a derogatory term if you a bald-headed penis this nigga. Not saying that that's Jeffrey Smith, but, you know, maybe. Looks like you niggas just fucking died. Yeah! It looks like you niggas just fucking died. Ooh, it looks like you dirty niggas just fucking died. I'm looking for the dude, looking for the dude with the attitude. Suck my balls, you dead bitch, hit you in the face, and what a disgrace. Yeah. Running around, kicking the ass. Oh my god, this too shall not pass. Look at you and you're getting shot. Fucking hit market, that's what I got for you. But victory. You guys are the biggest faggots. You ever. guys are the biggest. Why are you using a shotgun, using a shotgun, using a shotgun in a fight? Fu you shouldn't use, use guns, guns in a shooter. Jesus, you're my king. From the third time, die of cancer. Die of cancer. You are on your throne. Do you enjoy that loss? You lost though. Do you enjoy that loss? Do you enjoy that loss? Oh! Dog shit. Oh! You enjoy that loss? Oh! You enjoy that loss? Dia wanted me to destroy the user interface in this video, but Call of Duty. You have done that yourself. Play the crusty hamburger <laughs> clip here. <laughs> Talking to myself when I'm editing so Kaya. Call of Duty's user interface, combat flow, functional minimap, uh, features like player stats and scoreboard, they've all been destroyed, eviscerated, if you will. They weren't just killed, they were murdered. Thanks, Infinity Ward. <laughs> The games suck. Yep. I'm telling you, they're like B movies, but games. Oh god damn! It's frozen again. <laughs> What's happening? developing Call of Duty these days are so brain dead that in their haste to deliver an incomplete $70 early access game, they are actively undoing decade-old design, hilariously unaware of how much they're breaking in doing so. As Felikazoid would say, they took the If it ain't broke, break it approach with this one. They said fun? No, 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 no. Look how slow this reload is. Diet. What? I have something called 
Because the, the perks aren't unlocked at the beginning of the match. Of course. It's so much to remember about this slow dog shit game where even the equipment has fucking timers because of Jeffrey fucking Smith who had to slow this game way down to the point where I can't even reload my weapon. Like speed is everything. Their shockingly inept mentality is so flimsy and out of touch that a slight breeze could tear it apart. Any amount of testing might have acquainted these fucking losers with reality. Matter of fact, a JPEG of a suppressor has destroyed the garbage dump that is this numb nut developer philosophy of not wanting to punish shooters in your shooter, you dog water guzzling bitch. I think the problem is you're just uneducated. I've written among the bullet points in the script not to mention this dude's hair, and it's like... <laughs> Bitch, what hair? Maybe if you got rid of that old yiggy ass haircut you got, you get some bitches on your dick. Oh, better yet, maybe Tanisha will call y'all dog ass if she stopped fucking with that brain surgeon a lawyer she been fucking with. Nigga. Every lobby disbands, so you can't bully the bigots who aren't just sexist or racist, but the biggest sin of all, bad players. Rubbing the score in people's faces is what not only COD, but maybe any competitive game is all about, and anybody who's done that in their life should understand bragging rights. What a sad shame Americans can't craft a good gun game. An evolution, not a regression. We gotta ask Insomniac games to start making shooter games motherfucker you're like jesus christ you're also dreadfully incompetent 1v1 could never exist in today's call of duty because we can't organically have grudge matches anymore with every lobby exploding after a single match cod used to be fast now it's slow cod used to be about creating your class and playing to your strengths now perks are delayed unlocking camos by using your favorite gun no 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 obnoxious gunsmith nonsense forcing you onto other guns that you would never typically use yes 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 it's not just gimmicky homie it's the kind of seymour skinner wet fart reverberating in a large room that players expect from like a fucking pokemon game they definitely don't expect this to carry over into the good ones slower paced delayed perks timers on equipment for god's sake are you insane infinity ward jesus christ are your shirts soaked in your own saliva you drooling baboons what kind of studio would mix this garbage up silence is literally loud to you so up is down my nigga right take one look at the only available calling cards in the game right now and it all makes sense because signaling inclusion and representation in marketing is more important than launching a game at the seventy dollar price point complete and i used to tease transitioning call of duty uh <laughs> As a Rainbow Six wannabe, as developers taking the dinosaur out of Jurassic Park, but they should add a glass of water as a piece of equipment so you can put it on the ground so you can also see your enemies coming instead of just the dinosaur footsteps we can fucking hear from over like 20 meters away in the goddamn game because nobody should be moving in Jeffrey Smith, the multiplayer director's amazing Call of Duty 2022 experience. Let me say this to you. You had three fucking years to develop this. <sighs> You launched with no OG maps. <laughs> no OG Modern Warfare maps, no map voting. So welcome to the exploding car map, bro. How about Tarak? It's just like ruins. Very cool, right? Your maps are still not the right size for 6v6, let alone if only five or four people are in the lobby. And that happens because your game ain't ready, my nigga. Your game ain't ready. I am certain if Treyarch had this many issues at launch, this many missing features, stats, scoreboard missing, player record, challenges for God's sake, that they would be smart enough to establish a 24-7 Nuketown playlist because they would have launched with a map that would give the players what they want. That makes sense. You are disgusting, Infinity Ward. It is blatantly clear that not only has the talent departed, but the sense has as well. And when you can't make money because you're too stupid with so many decisions that I see that are honestly in a fight with trying to sell people things, <laughs> and that's your whole fucking game right now, you don't deserve to continue. And as an Activision thing, I don't know. Like and subscribe or dislike and comment something stupid in the comment section. You know I love to read it, baby. I'm sorry to anybody who wanted something better. Maybe it'll get there. 
Let's enjoy their excuses together. I mean it with all my heart. Infinity Ward is CODS343. And I'll show you. Love you. Later. Bye. 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 Bye.